Hello, patrons. Hi, patrons. Patrons of the arts, we have returned to you once again. Wow. Wow. Thanks for being patrons. We appreciate Thanks. you. And you've we returned to patron. us with your money Who is in hand. That? I think it's a it's a voice Julia did once that Thanks I really for like. Being a patron. <laughs> Fucking Toad. Thanks <laughs> yeah. for me for subscribing to his Patreon. <laughs> it's Toad after he lived in Brooklyn for like a decade. It's kind of Marge Simpson esque. <laughs> yeah, it's sort of Marge it's Simpson. Like, <laughs> be became Toad for a decade. Yeah, yeah. in yeah. in the big city. How's everybody doing Patreon. today? <laughs> I'm enough of this. So I guess it's nothing like Marge Simpson, really. <laughs> I think we should talk about the voice a little longer, not yeah, the show. Maybe the whole stream. <laughs> this is the voice. -na 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 -na. Yeah. Wait, hold on. The show with is yeah, this my please. voice song. Wait, oh, yeah, are we ready? You ready? turn around and you have to yeah. decide which one of us is singing. Okay. Mary had a little <laughs> lamb. Little lamb. That was Karina. <laughs> For sure. You got it. Wait, okay. <laughs> Karina's <Incorrect>. always <laughs> always singing that song. Okay, wait. <laughs> not, um, do not tell people that. I'm going to lie. I'm going to do a voice line, and Nathan, if you like oh, okay, it, hold on. you're going to have to turn around. Yeah, okay. Let me get back in position. Okay. Thanks for being a patron. Wow. Oh. I loved it. I, oh, I <laughs> scraped you. my knees on the wooden me. part of my <laughs> barrier. Was I really scraped good. my knees on the old town road. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> scrape my knees on the old town road. Um, is this a drawing stream? Yeah, I, dude. So I guess. I've heard. All right. Do you want to share so a drawing say... with us? I did a drawing. How do you like this drawing? Oh, wow. Oh, why is he yelling at me? What did I do? He's pressed and stressed. He's saying, thanks for being a patron. <laughs> he should say it with a less aggressive look on his face. Ugh. That's just his face. <laughs> men. <laughs> That's just how men's faces are. Yeah. He's got <laughs> resting panic that. face. <laughs> we can't all have resting panic face, dude. Stop being selfish. <laughs> <laughs> Karina, can I ask um, you a favor? Can you crank yes. your mic slider up on the roadcaster? Absolutely. Just like all the way. All the way to the top? Yeah. Oh, uh, there's Karina. She's all now the way I at can, the top. Now I can hear Karina. Sorry That's about much that. better. Thank you. How's my mic sound? Do I need to your do Your mic anything? sounds great right now. Nathan, actually, Aww, do you on want your attention, slider, Nathan? <laughs> yeah. on your slider, can you go down? Just down, like, just, all the just way? Just keep going down until it... And okay. Just sort of to the bottom? Just, like, yeah, if you could just... Bring that to the bottom. There we go. <laughs> there it is. That sounds really good. That's perfect. <laughs> wow, this is a peaceful stream. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a great time. <laughs> okay, put it back. I miss you. <laughs> oh, you don't have to put it back. Are you sure? Should I, should I keep it? Oh, he's, he's really quiet. Yeah, keep it like that. <laughs> <laughs> How about? Uh, I heard whispers of Nathan. Some How's say this? you can still uh, hear him. <laughs> Some say. How's this? Yeah, that's good. Is it back to wow. normal? It's back to normal. Yeah. It better it better be because that's as high as it goes. Um, what? <laughs> what do people want? What do people want? What do people want? What do you want? What do you people want? You called us here. You, sh you show up you give to us my money. stream. And now what? you want something? Alan I'm Wake sick 2. of you. <laughs> Alan Wake 2 exists yeah, already. Right. That's what they want. But again, please. We can't. We can't do Alan Wake 2 They didn't again. get enough of it. They want us to make another one. They think we can do it better than... Ooh, space whale. Have I drawn a space whale before? You've drawn a space a sp shark. Spail? Spail. Let's do it, Let's do it like Spail. this. Let's do one of these. What if I Are you getting experimental here? right off the rip? I mean, when it's in space... 
When it's in space? When it's in space. There we go. What are these? Oh my god, it's Ochi. That's where I want to be. Yeah. What is he doing here? Why does he look like He's that? <laughs> you can't just ask him why he looks like that. <laughs> but why does Anza he look like that? Anza sent me Ochi. He's my resident gay yellow thing. <laughs> 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 I thought that was Sherlock Holmes, but the one that's in Ace Attorney. Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> you thought that that Green is holding was Sherlock Holmes? No, her resident gay yellow thing. The resident oh. gay yellow thing. Um, he's got blonde hair. I would hair. describe him differently. Oh, okay. <laughs> I would use different words to describe that beast. Okay. <laughs> Fair. We can't say those words <laughs> on a patron stream. This I is... had this guy out when I was hanging out with my friend the other night. And over the course of the evening, she became so deeply endeared to him. <laughs> <laughs> he grows on you. <laughs> yeah, because he has like such a face. He has such a face and such a shape. Yeah, it's a good and shape, good at first, face. At first, she was like, Ugh, oh, why is his eyes like that? But then by the end of the night, she was just like, <laughs> I'm going to save up so much money for you for college. <laughs> <laughs> We're squirreling it all away so you can oh have a better God. life. I could see one eye of Ochi. <laughs> in the yeah. corner there. Of Ochi. The it's eye watching. of Ochi. <laughs> <laughs> when you're cooking and your your pet won't leave you alone. <laughs> I should I should show you this one picture because um, Ansta sent us so many nice things. She's the fucking goat. And one of the things she sent is a bunch of like little chocolates. Um, Ooh. So that's for all of us. But I did break in to them with my friend since it was Valentine's Day so we were sampling just a couple of them but they're like the fancy you know like when you buy like the nice chocolates and they have a little key to identify what the filling is that's the best I love yeah. that yeah um, well because that's what these are and it's uh, by the wrapper color well, I mean, then when you open it, you can see what color it is. But the key is so small, and there's so many flavors, and not all of them are in the box. Um, <laughs> it's a little so game. my yeah, my friend and I were just really struggling to like identify some of these. <laughs> I've sent a, a photo to our oh. little group chat, <laughs> but. Um, so I took a photo of her struggling, <laughs> and I forgot Ochi was in the background. <laughs> what are these flavors? Milk. Milk. Milk and milk. white. <laughs> My favorite flavor milk is white. milk and white. Milk and white. <laughs> My second milk favorite flavor, white. dark and milk. Milk and dark. <laughs> Next verse is salted milk. <laughs> salted milk. Oh, I'm a salted milk hater. <laughs> In the park. <laughs> Gump doesn't know what's in the chocolate box. It must not be a fancy one with a key. But yeah, I kept saying Damn. that we were doing the same thing my parents do when they try to read a menu in like a slightly less bright restaurant where they like pull out their phone. <laughs> pull out the magnifying <laughs> glass. <laughs> yeah, and their they phone. have like the flashlight on and they're just like. <laughs> yeah, full flashlight. And that was, mode. that was us in, our in, in the fully lit living room because <laughs> we were just struggling to tell the colors of the wrappers <laughs> apart because we're like, this is. Is either hazelnut or you barry melon? <laughs> and that's and a I don't big want difference. you barry melon. <laughs> I don't know if I can handle if, getting that wrong. <laughs> if you're expecting hazelnut and you get you barry melon, that's basically a, a prank video. That's it for you. <laughs> that's a hate crime. <laughs> uh, you just reminded yeah. me. My my parents were visiting my brother, and he just sent me a, a picture of them, like with the full menu reading like gear out. <laughs> gear. They look like gear up. they look like all the shit you put on like an old school Game Boy. It's got like the magnifier and like the worm light. Yeah the little swirly lamp. Yeah. <laughs> 
but I just really like the photo I, I took of her because I was just snapping like a weird little photo to show Ansta that we were struggling with the chocolates. And she's very seriously reading the key, but then off to the side, Ochi's just sitting on the couch like <laughs> yeah, <looking laughs> eye vacant. emoji, mouth emoji, eye emoji. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you reminded me we were at a restaurant not too long ago and i thought this Ooh. restaurant they were they were in freaking you know 2000 and, and 44 they were not 2000 and late they're 20 years in the future because wow. they had on their tables in the place where like a candle would normally be it was like a like a rod, a thin rod like a candle with a little light on top and like a little lampshade so it cast the light down onto the table and you could okay. hold your menu under it and you could read it even though it was a dim restaurant. And I was like, damn, damn this is some genius shit. How about we just stop making the restaurants dim? They can't stop doing that. That's the one thing the they can't food do. food grossness. <laughs> I kind of like to see no. <laughs> what I'm what I'm getting up to. <laughs> they want to get closer and closer to pitch black in the restaurant where all you can see is the people <laughs> immediately around you. Anyway, I thought Damn. it was neat. That's neat. It was cool because you could like talk to people without uh, having this like a light shining so brightly in your eye from beneath yeah. you and making everyone look like horror monsters but also you're not worried about setting your little menu on fire and also yeah. it lights better than those stupid tea light candles yep <laughs> that's why I'm saying yeah. you need the light above it those tea lights are so low it's a cool whale Nathan <laughs> hey cool whale Nathan so cool it's just a space whale. Spice I wonder whale. if it's just because I don't like going out at night that I'm just like, why must the restaurants also be dark? <laughs> it's the vibes. You have to feel like you're in a cave. I like sunlight. <laughs> then go eat in the daytime. <laughs> yeah, I typically try to. <laughs> well, good. Then keep doing it and keep that attitude out of my dim night restaurants. <laughs> <Bo>. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be I need a restaurant where every surface is like covered in LEDs. <laughs> <laughs> it's the opposite of like a dark concept restaurant. It's the way too bright concept restaurant. Yeah, it's a restaurant. The table in, is a lamp. It's in the light chairs mode. are a lamp. <laughs> it's in light mode. <laughs> Somebody forgot to put the restaurant in dark mode. <laughs> Get flashbangs. <laughs> yeah, I want to go. I want to walk into that restaurant. It's like the fucking iCarly meme. <laughs> Where she walks into a room and just yeah. gets blinded. <laughs> That's a good one. I've never watched that show, but that, it's a good. It's a very gifable show. Is what is what yes, I, a gifable program. A gifable program. <laughs> mm. Oh, I call it one of the most gifable programs of. Was that a, I could was that a Nick, Was that a Nickelodeon or a or a Disney? Nickelodeon. A That's a Nick. That's a Nick for sure. I knew it. I was <laughs> that was testing you, and you got it right. I do. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Grandpa. Let's get you back to bed. <laughs> I didn't feel read this menu when I answered it. I think they should bring me my come. flashlight. He's grandpa. I think they should make a <laughs> restaurant where every light are those like germ killing. Um, what what are those oh, lights? Like the UV. Yeah, UV lamps. Every surface is a UV lamp, and then invite a bunch of NFT bros to go <laughs> hang out there. Just kidding. Another... They already did that. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't they all get like sunburned or something? They all got like. Or temporary blinded. Or blinded. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I have a restaurant pitch. Mm hmm It's a, a murder mystery themed restaurant where the only yes. way to be able to read your menu is to spray the piece of paper with luminol and pull out a black light. 
Ooh. <laughs> and then you can see person. who's been doing inappropriate stuff with their menu. One person's got a menu that says you're the victim. And then you have to pretend to die. Yeah. Yeah. And everyone else has to solve it. Is the murderer. Yeah, one person gets the you're the murderer menu. (laughs) And you get to play a big like game of werewolf. (laughs) With strangers. Imagine just having to have dinner, but there's also luminol everywhere. (laughs) (laughs) People are spraying it. Place. I got luminol on my food. <laughs> it's actually not luminol. It's like that's how you spray. <gasps> that's how you like season your food. Oh, oh like yeah. The, oh. the wait the, the waiter comes by and he's dressed like Emma from Ace Attorney, <laughs> and he's just like, "Would you like some Parmesan cheese?" And then he sprays it. On he uses one of those like salt and pepper grinders that has a little light at the bottom that's like automatic. Have you ever seen those? <laughs> I've seen those. Yeah. Great you for a damn those? restaurant. You guys, you, you guys know about this? You heard about this? Because you fucking... want to know how much pepper you're putting on. <laughs> but the restaurant's so dark. I just, because I've been gently sitting in on like Lil Karibo and Marin and Subi playing like Ace Attorney and then I just hang out there and giggle. But like, so I was like replay, like like, re-experiencing some of Apollo Justice for like the first time since when I played it as a kid. And I do just love that when you'd have to do like the mini game investigation parts, it's so like, (laughs) It's uh, Emma, the detective, being like, um, so you need to pour this cement and then use a hair dryer to blow it with your touch screen and your microphone, and I can't do it for you. <laughs> it does but, feel like um, Baby's First Science Kit. <laughs> it's so Baby's First Science Kit, and it's so funny considering that it's like technically you're working under a detective. <laughs> and she's like, okay, so check this out. <laughs> it's plaster. Anyway, they should turn those mini games into how they serve the food at this restaurant yeah i love that (laughs) it's like a little like plate with a shoe print in it and you they have to like pour (laughs) your food on it (laughs) or like you have to excavate (laughs) you have to excavate your burger like a tiramisu (laughs) clue whoa nathan you're right And the Thank clue you. is there's a tooth inside of your tiramisu Ew. that you find. <laughs> tiramisu tooth. <laughs> Toothy me clue. Toothy me Toothy clue. Me clue. <laughs> uh, I'm done. <laughs> Nathan, this, this is, is a beautiful drawing. This yeah, is my this space is whale. Yeah. I want you guys you really to know drew that. this while we were saying Toothy me clue. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want you guys to know that what Al said came in and said, hi, everyone, what did I miss? And back to back, someone wrote so much, <laughs> Al, and someone immediately said, not much, Al. <laughs> Figure that's, it out, It's true. Al. So much and not much together. Yeah. That's, <laughs> that's what our streams are. Um, is I'm going to pass it back to one of y'all. Yeah. We'll go uh, Karina mode. Okay. It's got a suggestion for Karina. Did you guys see the please the the fake restaurant that opened on the Upper West Side? Huh? Fake uh, restaurant? What? Did you say fake restaurant? Yeah. Basically, these guys would go to their friend's place. Uh, I think it was like right after we could like see people during COVID, hmm. and his friend like got really into cooking. And so they started like fake reviewing his apartment as like a as a oh, restaurant and saying fine. it was like five stars. But then people kept checking in on this restaurant and trying to make reservations. So they opened a fake restaurant on the first floor of some building. Huh. And um, the wait list, it took like a, it had like a year long wait list in order to get in and they had actors who would come in and have like a fake proposal um all these like big dramatic things and then they revealed it's just like not a real restaurant so this whole thing was just like i won't guess i won't access my brushes because what's going on it's not the okay there the fucking zoom menu was in the way Uh, Uh, typical of my 
cracked fucking screen. Zoom I do really remember... is is very needy as yeah. a program. It really wants to be like you. You know, I you have options with me, right? <laughs> You're using me for this call, but I you can do other stuff too. <laughs> I just want to say, Julia, I remember that. Thank you. The fake restaurant. Yes. I remember hearing Sorry, about it. I was after having. You told me. I was trying to troubleshoot. <laughs> it's all good. Um, I um I didn't remember that, but I am glad to know about it. It's just a fun, stupid yeah. thing. I love a, a restaurant. I went to a restaurant that. Shut like, up! Shut oh. up! <laughs> okay. Should I do OG Herlock Sholmes or Ace Attorney Cats based on the ones I got? Mm, I want to see Ochi. Okay. Ochi for me. Ochi, You may Ochi unshut me. up now. Thank you. Nathan, what restaurant were you talking about? I don't know. <laughs> Nathan's never been to a restaurant, actually. I've never been to a restaurant. I was just trying to sound cool for you guys. <laughs> well, it didn't work. It didn't work. <laughs> Try again next I got, time. I got yelled at. Nathan um, was going to be like, I went to this restaurant one time and they had, you could look at the at the paper with, it, it had was, a list. Uh -huh. It had a list of food. Um, items. And you didn't have to get all the food, <laughs> but you could get, you could just pick one of the food and then you, they would, you pick the food and get this. You didn't even need to cook it yourself someone else did that isn't that does that sound like what happens is that at that a restaurant sound, and then you and then you give them money at the before or after they bring you the food it was sometimes crazy. It, it's before but sometimes it's after the food and i experienced this <laughs> personally <laughs> and i and i and i was i for sure did that i i did the i did the the pick the food i did the get the food i and i i ate i ate the food Check and i this shit out i and went then to I a paid. place and they gave me the food i asked for <laughs> when i asked for it and then uh, but not right away they had there was a little time between when i asked for it and when i got the food I don't really know what they were doing for that time, I, but yeah, I couldn't I see them. I couldn't I, they see weren't, them. They weren't in my line of sight. There was a person who brought me the food, and that was not the same person who made the food. I think. It was Bone Tricks person. Art said, "I believe him." <laughs> Thank you for believing. Me. <laughs> Someone's got to stand up for Nathan and believe him. <laughs> believe Nathan. Oh, look at him. This is a friend. Once again, I forgot that Ochi only has two legs. Yeah. What else do you need? What else do you need? Four. If you're shaped like that, you need four. No. He's subverting expectations. He's he's Stop dog trying to change him. He's Dad. dog coded, but then he got he only got two. He only needs two. Okay, he's perfectly a, balanced on two. We got a cat. Cat alert. Joyce Sorry. here. Nobody panic. Go away. Hey Joy. <sighs> you gonna lay down my lap again? Calm. Hi, sweetie. Hi. You have so much schmutz on your face. Schmutz? Schmutz. She's schmutzing around. She's got a bunch of schmutz. She's schmutzed up. What's wrong with your face? Have you tried cleaning it? Ochi. Ochi, I love you. <laughs> Ochi, they really like hit the exact perfect balance of unsettling and perfect with Ochi. Yeah. And that's why he's my best friend. They in broke the, the mold with this one. Yeah. yeah. No, never okay, will they make the another game. like him. And that's why. 
I worship him as my god. That's why I'm starting <laughs> a cult. That's why I'm starting a cult. And um, <laughs> it's called Ochi. Ochi's World. Smiley <laughs> a- face heart. <laughs> Ochi's World smiley face heart. Yeah. <laughs> It's the uh, the first cult to have emoji in the name. <laughs> and if you join, I'm just different like that. I will teach you how to devochi to ochi. <laughs> devochi to ochi. Devochi. <laughs> devochi to ochi. That's what we say. To binky. To bitchy. No, no, no. No. We devote Sorry, you. I got really excited. <laughs> if you love him so much, where's the emote? We do have on Twitch. We've we got have Lagochi. We have Lagochi. I'm I don't know if I devote you to Lagochi. <laughs> I don't know Chi if I devote you. I don't know Chi. <laughs> <laughs> something something Zendaya is Michi <laughs> Zendaya is Mochi <laughs> does everyone actually like Ochi yes yeah everybody actually likes Ochi everybody, everybody actually <laughs> we speak for everybody on uh, just yeah. on this, not on anything else. No, but when it comes to Ochi, I think we can safely speak for everyone, the entire population of the planet Earth and the universe. Or maybe some some other pla- right? Because Olimar is not from Earth, and he he likes yeah. Ochi too. So the everyone entire loves Ochi, the entire multiverse, multiverse. Mochiverse. Mochiverse. Well, I, I like do, the little hair tuft. I like him wearing a little outfit. That's pleasing to yeah, me. Yeah, I think I think you're we're on to something with that. They should give Ochi more outfits. Yeah. <laughs> Parentheses he is naked. <laughs> <laughs> He's naked all the time. This dialogue would kill a Victorian man. (laughs) (laughs) You telling me this dialogue would kill Herlock Sholmes? Yeah, Herlock Sholmes wouldn't be able to hear this. That's the greatest irony. And it's about him, kind of. In part. I'm not convinced most things could kill Herlock Sholmes. Yeah, the the average person today can can see more ochi oh, than this. than the, the richest kings of medieval europe <laughs> all so the true. money and all the jewels would not get them a single glimpse of ochi <laughs> yeah <laughs> think about that think about how lucky we are to be alive what a time we live in <laughs> oh my god <laughs> <laughs> I have one joke this this week and it's her are you fucking stupid me <laughs> this, this face, face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah same it's a little bow. Same though. <laughs> JW said I thought he was going to say the average person today could kill a Victorian man. That too. Well, well, yeah. And I think honestly, I think if you pit like 1v1 all of the Victorian men against an equivalent <laughs> number of average people today, I don't know. The Victorian men are going down. I don't know. They had a lot of uh blue collar like. workers. Oh. Yeah, I guess it depends. Miners. That's true. Well, but they were also very unwell. Less office workers. <laughs> they were very unwell. Because <laughs> they were in the mines. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, all you need to do is, is yeah. kite them for a little bit and they'll run out of breath. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that's also I I... me. I sit at my desk I'm from all day. the future. I have like a 300 lumen flashlight 
I think yeah. that's all you need. You need it. Yeah. <laughs> 300 <those> lumens. Minors. <laughs> and, yeah. so, and some of those, um, some of those electric scooters. And you just kite, you just kite them around for a while. Yeah, just give them a four loco. Yeah, yeah Julia, you got you got like several bright flashlights. That's true. And a baseball bat. Yeah, we have we have assault rifles. We don't need to we don't need to escalate that far. Yeah, why are you no. getting so violent? I think I think the flashlights and ele and electric scooters are going to be enough for the Victorian men. <laughs> Yeah, I want to see what's the minimum tool set we could get away with. But I think also that like the Victorian men were being prescribed like straight heroin. Yeah. I don't know if that helps them or hurts them. I don't know either. Yeah. Just make sure they're like on that shit and then give them a charged lemonade. <laughs> Win. Easy. Yeah, all you have to do Take to kill to Panera. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Uh, kill a Victorian man and bring Panera. him to Panera. <laughs> One charged lemonade from Panera could wipe out an entire battalion of Victorian men. Yeah. It's okay. Put it in a bread bowl. They keep passing it around and taking sips because they they are obsessed with lemons. They don't get to taste lemons because they're Victorian yeah. men. Citrus. <laughs> Citrus from know. the New World. <laughs> <laughs> a treat worth dying for citrus and sugarcane <laughs> and what's this other flavor i detect <laughs> oh my heart oh my god oh, if my I, heart. I had like Zounds. a victorian man you know what i would do with him what would i would take him to him? one of those places that does like a 3d scan of you and print like 3d prints a little guy <laughs> <laughs> I would do that just to like <laughs> rile him up <laughs> and be like that your soul is in here yeah this is you now and if I break it you'll die he's gonna overtake you <laughs> yeah <laughs> you know what I think would immediately kill Victorian man bringing them not even fully into a pachinko parlor in Japan yeah. just like the first doors oh my god take them to Dave and Buster's <laughs> Pachinko parlors are so impossible loud. That's true. <laughs> they just pass out. Yeah. Get him a big plate of chicken wings. Oh my god. Put that beast in like, <laughs> like the mosh pit. <laughs> like any concert, any stadium concert. I thought you were gonna say a Dave and Buster's. And a Dave and the mosh pit at Dave and Buster's. <laughs> Or that. Yeah, just put them at like the playground in a McDonald's or something. Oh, the ball pit. Yeah. Lock them in an abandoned mall. I don't know. <laughs> There's lots of ways we could do it, I yeah, think is what I we're think, getting at here. Yeah, I think we're I think we're good. If if Victorian men ever start showing up to pick fights, I think we're I think I think we we've got it covered before we ever need to get to assault rifles. I also just want to acknowledge Nathan's <laughs> use of zounds. <laughs> this Thank dude you. is zounding. I'm sounding off in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> this is a good meme, Karina. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay i think i think i did it yeah you did <laughs> let me just <sighs> spacing so what are the chats that a harder challenge is to keep a victorian man alive yeah it's like, it's, <laughs> would you rather have to take care of an egg or one victorian, <laughs> or <a> victorian man, <laughs> man. <laughs> i don't want to take care of a victorian man they're always going to be like writing letters by candlelight to their loved ones and shit <laughs> Show them your little <laughs> restaurant light. <laughs> gonna be getting, I think Karina's for keyboard noises could be a Victorian man. <laughs> <laughs> what, you, like, you like my keyboard noises? Tugga, 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 tugga. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. It's called ambiance. The sound of yeah. me murdering a Victorian need, man. Gonna need an ambulance okay. for that ambiance. Damn, we're killing it today, dude. 
Thank you. <laughs> we're we're enough. saying it's some enough. some funny <laughs> shit today. I'm pretty <laughs> sure if you put a stethoscope up to a Victorian man, his breathing would sound like Karina's keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll rattle. He's got so many Shaking teeth in his teeth. lungs. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Joy's here. Someone said, "Oh, Joy, yeah, she's here." She's been very lappy today. She spent all morning Aww. screaming at the bedroom door, and then we let her in. Jacob let her in because I was still half asleep. And then she did this thing where she lays on Jacob's chest and just slowly touches his face really gently. She was in a big Aww. face touching mood this morning. She was just like Cute. stroking my cheek with her paw. Oh yeah. I'm like, what, what is this? What are we doing? And then she would get both paws <laughs> on like either side of my face. And then she bit your chin. And then she bit my chin. Oh, <laughs> what do you accomplish? <laughs> She doesn't know. One. She just do. She just She's do. Just She's do. doing. She acts right? on instinct. Right. All right. I'm gonna draw me killing a Victorian man <laughs> using Good. the method of scooter and flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> it's just okay. Yeah, that's the new like party game like icebreaker game is just like look around the room what would you use to kill a victorian man <laughs> <laughs> i would just take all my little anime girl figurines like the small ones and be like they're fae <laughs> they're How going indecent. to curse your bloodline <laughs> Can see her ankles. Size Harry. <laughs> this woman is showing her ankles, and this woman, gets. <laughs> what is she doing with that broom? <laughs> I'd be like, this is a fae. You are going to die. <laughs> <laughs> Hands you this. <laughs> this is going to be the Victorian man. Oh yeah, I can already tell. See the, his Victorian nose. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Jacob, I want to know. <laughs> wow. Those are good shapes already. I want to note to you, Jacob. Olive started cleaning her belly, and then she immediately moved on. Wow, it's a new era. Is she improving? Seems like she's improving. She her. learned her lesson. She's no longer on the medicine that makes her sad. Yeah. <laughs> her downers. Her depressants. I ran out of my allergy medicine. And there's an allergy medicine that I was taking for a while. And then I had to stop because it was making me horribly depressed. Damn. But I ran out of my usual allergy medication last night. So I was forced to take the horribly no. depressive She's like, allergy right, meds back on the depressing pills. do you want to oh. breathe or be happy yeah <laughs> only choose one <laughs> dang sorry You've my new pills are arriving choices. tomorrow <laughs> oh, that's rough breathe or be happy <laughs> oh yeah look at this freaking guy this man just turned 17 <laughs> it's his seventeenth oh. birthday today, <laughs> <laughs> and this is what happened to him. We took him to Dave and Buster's to celebrate, and he died. He had one four loco. <laughs> we he had one loco, only a fourth of a four loco. <laughs> he didn't even reach the fourth loco. <laughs> <laughs> my master told me never to do this but I'm going to reach the fourth loco <laughs> open gates fourth loco. fourth loco domain expansion you just hear the crack of a <laughs> can domain expansion fifth loco do they, still, do they still do four loco is that still a thing even no don't they not in like the do same they? way yeah it's like a different loco right it was loco. made illegal when it was <laughs> causing too many <laughs> yeah. injuries and deaths <laughs> your four just... is too loco your swag is too different you killed <laughs> <laughs> and 
What a what a crazy like six months or however long those were available before everyone was like, oh no, that, you shouldn't do that. It's okay. We re we replaced it with another drink that can kill you. Yeah, it doesn't, there will it doesn't always get be you. a drink that can kill you. <laughs> yeah, now now you can just get it at the at the soda tap <laughs> at Panera, <laughs> and it doesn't even get you drunk. It just gets you so hype. <laughs> Deathly levels of hype. Yeah, <laughs> alarmingly hype. Joy, are you also having allergies today? Because you're just sitting here with your eyes closed, but your mouth open. I just hear. <laughs> of joy breathing. It's okay, sweetie. I learned it from watching you. Yeah, basically. Poor Jacob, who hates sneezing noises, has to live with the three sneeziest creatures on the planet Earth. <laughs> Olive will just sneeze like 27 times in a row. Yeah. <laughs> it's absurd. Awesome. She does this little like... Pff, 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 pff. And I'm like, damn, that sneeze of yours is absurd. <laughs> Holy fucking fuck. <laughs> Holy fucking fuck. <laughs> I think I told you guys that my friend uh, had to do like a radiation treatment on her cat to like, yeah. help with some chronic problems. And so now he's just like gently radiated for at least yeah. another week at this point. Just so he's just walking around cat. being a radioactive cat. <laughs> and he's a very like cuddly, like affectionate cat. So they're only supposed to like cuddle with him no more than 30 minutes a day. But one of the first things he did was walk up to my friend and sneeze on her. <laughs> <laughs> it's a radio cat Radio captive. He's breathing in slide. the chemicals. Aren't we all? <laughs> He's sneezing out the chemicals. <laughs> this is a Victorian man. Yeah. yeah, this is a Victorian 17 yeah. year old. <laughs> yeah, 17 on the dot. Hail and hearty for a 17 year old, too. <laughs> no, no, we're going to Panera. Not, not that I'm not, not Hale and Hardy. Hale and <laughs> what? what are you talking about, old man? <laughs> and then this is going to be me. A I'm on a, I'm on a Segway. Pass out. <laughs> oh my God, me. Jacob, we have a topic <laughs> to discuss today. Topic to discuss. Ooh, I love a topic to discuss. What's, what's the topic? Jacob Hard and I topic. watched a movie last night. What movie? Oh. We watched the movie Valentine's Day. Oh. That has everyone in it. It's an ensemble oh, cast. The every, it's, 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 it's the, a love actually. We, yeah. It's a, it's yeah. a love actually like. Like. <laughs> like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, with Taylor Swift. Oh, yeah. Half the plot lines in Valentine's Day are not plot lines. They're just things that happen. Yeah. Like Taylor Swift's plot line. She just comes in, says something nerdy, and then makes out with Taylor Lautner. Nice. That's pretty much true, yeah. Does yeah. she play herself? Or no, she's like some guy. She's some guy. She's just like normal. Yeah. She's, she's just like a, a sort of like the ditzy type. Just normal men. Is she supposed to be a high schooler? Yeah. 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 Because she was. I've never actually watched this, but I've watched at least like one review of it. And yeah, she's like a cheerleader. Because get it? Yeah. She has a song about. She's cheer she's captain. A cheerleader and I'm on the bleachers. The bleachers. Yeah. Yeah. But she, but she's both, but in that, in the music video for that, she's both. Yeah. For some reason, when that song was like really new and I was in high school and we'd be riding around with my one friend who had a car and we'd listen to that song, we would always go like, she's cheer captain and I'm on the floor. And we thought that was so funny. And now I just can't stop thinking about it anytime I hear that lyric. Why did, why did you think it was funny? I don't know. It is. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Damn. It's, 
<laughs> it really, it's really mid at best. <laughs> <laughs> It's, I mean, it is funny, the juxtaposition of she is something and I'm in a, in a location. Uh, and I am nothing. <laughs> I'm just on the floor. I'm just on the floor. I'm trying to remember other plot lines. Everyone in that movie is truly just like there. Well, you know that like, that adage where they like, they try and trick you, and then it's like, actually, the doctor was a woman. That's mm -hmm. what every plot line feels like in this. There, how many uh, women doctors are there in none? Uh, none. There's only one doctor, <laughs> wow. and he's cheating on his wife. Yeah. Oh, the, the doctor was a cheater. With Jennifer well, Garner. Duh. Yeah. Of course. Men Jennifer just Garner take... doesn't know about it, though. That's yeah. the most messed up part. Yeah. Also, the only good acting in that whole movie is um, Julia Roberts and what's his name? Bradley Cooper. Bradley Richard Cooper. Gere. And you oh. see them, oh, I yeah. think, for a total of four minutes. I kept yeah, joking just, like, to Julia. Because they're just vibing on a plane. As we, yeah. yeah. As we were watching it, I was like, it's really funny that Julia Roberts and Bradley Cooper are just up in a plane being better actors than anyone else. Like, they're just <laughs> sort of, like, sequestered away. Yeah, where they don't interact yeah. with anyone else, and they're just like having like like charming conversations on a plane. Yeah, and then oh, Taylor yeah, Swift is doing like the worst football acting player. I've ever seen. And they're on yes. a plane. It is the gay football player one. Yeah, <laughs> she's your captain, and I'm in the sky. And I'm a gay football on a plane. player. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite part about him revealing that he was a gay football player, and they were like. Sir, are you going to retire? And he goes, I'm gay. And they went, okay, but are you going to retire? And he says, no, yeah, so I'm gay. <laughs> and I'm going to play. And I'm going to play. <laughs> oh, it rhymes. That's I'm nice. gay and I'm going to play. <laughs> and in that moment, they knew. <laughs> See, I was trying to remember some of the subplots, but there's also the New Year's Eve one. Yep. And I couldn't remember which ones went to which. Yeah, I haven't seen the New Year's one. I just I know uh, uh, Leah Michelle, whatever, is is in the New Year's Eve Leah one. Michelle the Glee Girl? Geller. Glee. Glee Girl. Girl. Leah Michelle Glee Geller. Girl. Uh-huh. I'm purposefully conflating two names. Is that, yeah. the, is that like a, a theatrical Buffy? As a joke. A th uh, yeah, musical theater Buffy. Oh, a joke. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm making like a really funny joke. I saw a really good tweet the other day that was, thank God Glee ended before Hamilton started. Mm. I think about that all the time because there was like a Tumblr post that like... Compl like absolutely predicted exactly how a Hamilton Glee episode would go. Oh God! <laughs> and people are just re were just replying to it like, I feel like I've seen this actually. <laughs> are, are we sure this didn't really happen? <laughs> Joy so congested. <sighs> yeah, what's other plot lines that happen? Um. George Lopez is in that movie. Yeah, there's like the florist guy, and yeah, they had like a Kutcher. precocious child. Oh my god, the precocious child delivered every line like a robot. Ooh, it was really <laughs> funny. Yeah, love that. I have to go get the flowers, or else she won't know that I love her. <laughs> and... and I was like, "What the hell?" Oh yeah, one of them was having like an anti Valentine's party that was yeah that's jessica beale jessica beale jamie fox that movie has a lot of subplots yeah way too many <laughs> everything feels like a subplot other than ash and kutcher being a florist i think is the only one that doesn't feel like a subplot she's cheer captain and i'm a florist <laughs> <laughs> Assigned florist at birth. <laughs> Assigned oh, yeah. plot. Beef that butt up, Jacob. Thank you. Victorians, they don't understand how big butts can get in our era. 
Yeah. So I've gotten like a butt implant in this scenario. Oh, okay. You got a BBL? I got a BBL to confuse him. <laughs> That's dedication, Jacob. I got Jacob. a BBL to confuse him. <laughs> And so what is like the reason you flashed. would like a BBL to confuse a Victorian man? Oh, of course. <laughs> I have to enter into the sort of a death competition with him, so. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been getting a lot of those recently. <laughs> Ever since the time flux happened and Victorian men began pouring into our time sphere. That is one of, like, my favorite... Um, uh, sort of subplots I keep seeing happening with like Christmas rom-coms and shit where it's, you know, like the man from the past who is also charming and handsome um, and modern woman who somehow time traveled yeah. or vice versa. And, um, but it's always the man who's from the past. Um, but yeah, cause I watched another one. Rachel McAdams. Huh? because <laughs> i watched another one while i was home for christmas and it was about like um she there it was like a magic hourglass and it takes her back to like the 20s and it's like old hollywood or some shit um but then the movie ends with him uh time traveling to the future to join her and then there was the Vanessa Hudgens one where it's like a medieval knight who does like the same thing. Well, because I think if it was a woman who was traveling from the past, you won't get that tension of like, I want to return back to my time where I have no mm. rights <laughs> and I can own no money or property <laughs> or vote. I just think it's so funny because by the end of the movie, I'm always just like, you know, that man is stinky and racist and probably not vaccinated. Like, that's true. Yeah, you wouldn't want to. It always just like cracks man. me up. I'm just like, girl, why? He probably has like two teeth. Yeah. And, and like lungs. A, a, a secret plague. <laughs> and racism. <laughs> This is great, Jacob. <laughs> Me. <laughs> wow. His last You're destroying words. him. Zounds. He, the last he got thing a little. Got to say. He, he got a few hits in, though, it looks like. You're not at full. You're not capped off. No, that was self inflicted. Oh, okay. That was yeah, from the BBL. From the BBL. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they removed some of your health bar and put it in your ass. I, I turned in a little <laughs> bit of my max HP to increase my ass size. Yeah. <laughs> couple years off my life but i think it was worth it uh okay wow. i'm done this is how i'd kill a victorian man yeah he's he's about to die he's toast get his ass get his ass uh julie you want to draw yeah i do have a cat in my lap so i don't know how we want to navigate this well just you throw might her. have to just slide over slide over julie you want to slide over with me well, she might leave Cha -cha that's slide. always the risk. Watch your tootsies. Cha cha, real smooth. <laughs> do, 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 Are you leaving now? Or are you gonna stay? You could stay. You little gremlin. Stay with me. Cause you're a kitty. Oh. oh. That's I don't cute. think that's how, because you're on the floor. Because you're on the floor. <laughs> what am I drawing you That's so funny. <laughs> so funny. Yeah, what should Julia draw? This is, this. I like this. I don't. Who's this? This is Joy when she was asleep in my lap. Oh. That's you're her when she was asleep? Like this. Here's a Sorry, but you're lying open. Open. <laughs> I hope she doesn't look like that asleep. Draw a plot point from Valentine's Day. Oh my god, actually. That's a, that sounds funny. <laughs> you want this? What do you mean Eugene tax season? Yeah. <laughs> Point. I was about to say he doesn't pay taxes, but he sure Eugene does. filing his taxes. Yeah. He thought he could do it by himself, but yeah, he just looks really. It's stressed actually out. a lot. Yeah, it actually, is a lot harder than he expected. 
Which plot point of Valentine's Day should I draw? We never talked about the Anne Hathaway one. Oh, Anne Hathaway's in there too. And Good for, Topher oh, Grace. Yeah. Topher mm-hmm. Grace. Anne Hathaway is a secret phone sex yeah. operator. She secretly is like a dommy mommy on the phone. And yeah, for some nice. reason she keeps doing it while she's working like her job job. Yeah. For Queen Latifah. She I think her issue is that she'll answer calls to be a dommy mommy at literally any hour of the day or night as they come in. I mean Yeah. And just like interrupt whatever she's doing, including being on a date, to go like do do some dommy mommy for like a minute. That's that hustle lifestyle, you know? You gotta make that cash money. You gotta do what you love. It turns you know? out she has student loans yeah so it's kind of a you know a commentary on money mommies mommies monies and mommies (laughs) monies and mommies mommies (laughs) (laughs) america higher education yeah She's also like, I don't have health insurance. Damn. But she has a job. She works for Queen Latifah. Uh, which apparently no. doesn't yeah. give her... I guess Queen Latifah's not giving her health insurance. No. Damn. But she's like... I forget. Did she, like, have that job or was it a new job? She had that job and is, like, Queen Latifah's personal assistant, it seems like. Dang. And then she towards the end, one of the Dami Mommy calls comes in, but Queen Latifah answers it. And you're like, uh oh, Anne Hathaway is going to get in trouble. But no, Queen Latifah just starts Dami Mommying oh. the person who called. And, and she loves it. And she loves it. She loves being a Dami Mommy? <laughs> yeah. And that's, Everyone likes and that's being what a Dami Mommy. Finally convinces her to give her health insurance. No, she doesn't give her health insurance. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing changes. She's just like, yeah. <laughs> just like, can I do that sometimes? <laughs> I know what I know what you are. How does that one end again? Uh, basically, Topher Grace finds out she's a dommy mommy on the phone, and then is like, I can't deal with that. I'm from Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> he's Mr. Sings from Ohio. I'm Mr. Sings from Ohio and I can't deal with that. And then he they he leaves and she's like, "Wow, you found out one thing you didn't like about me and now all of a sudden you're running away." And then he runs away and then he talks to an old man and then he realizes he made a mistake and he comes the back old, and is like, the "Old man's like, you're you're dating the dummy mommy I talked to? <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome." It's awesome. <laughs> she could do that back and for you like, for free. Fine. Although I think he had a right to be mad because she did leave their Valentine's Day date for like half an hour to go dummy mommy some guy on that's the phone. That's a long, that's a long that, Yeah, I was about to say like, <laughs> you can't just leave to go, like, you can't step out to do that. They have set amount of times you're expected to Yeah, it should be by appointment, for, right? right? Like it shouldn't be just like whenever yeah. anyone calls you. They could just hit you up. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like she had like her business practices are are questionable. She needs to set yeah, some boundaries. Yeah, it's a little loosey goosey. She needs to set boundaries. Uh, oh this, yeah, Jessica this... Alba is also in it. And I just realized that her plot line, like nothing happens. No, it goes nowhere. She's like Ashton Kutcher's like at the beginning of the movie proposes to her and she's like yes I do and then half an hour later she's like actually no I don't and mm. then she just leaves <laughs> and then she just leaves and you occasionally like see her doing stuff for the rest of the movie but nothing ever like resolves in any sort of way with her but she doesn't have to be married to Ashton Kutcher while she does that stuff no so that's at least a benefit so there you go Good for her. <laughs> <laughs> and she that's does something. take his dog she takes his dog it seems Where? to imply that it's his dog but that the dog likes her better and so the dog leaves with her damn this guy sucks <laughs> the last you see of her is that she goes to a hotel to check in and then she's like I'm sad anyway <laughs> that's the last you'll <laughs> anyway, see of me anyway I have me. a dog now <laughs> So is that is that who you you're drawing? 
Yeah, yeah. So is this is this sad Jessica Alba with Ashton Kutcher's dog? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. it's a real movie. It's it's people were trying to capitalize on that love actually. Yeah, hype train. It's not, like love yeah. actually like was good, and people were so charmed by it, and they were like, we just need to do that, like ourselves for just every holiday as many celebrities and little almost plots into a, a yeah. film all they have to do is meet up at some point so yeah how hard can it be taylor swift help <laughs> <laughs> so yeah they, they did new year's eve valentine's day mother's day right isn't mother's yeah. day one is there a mother's day one is there i think, I think there's a, a mother's day one can't wait to watch that one on Mother's Day. When is Mother's Day? May. Oh, hell yeah. We didn't miss it. Mother's it's we not didn't too miss late. It. It's not too late. We don't have to go back. <laughs> okay, so that are we do are we doing another plot point now, Julia? Yeah. Okay, so we got sad Jessica Alba with Ashton Kutcher's dog now is this the precocious child yeah i hated the child plot point so much <laughs> some people in chat are disagreeing with uh that love actually was good but i think you misinterpreted what karina said she said it was good like when it came out yeah. when you watch it today it's like love yeah. insane yeah but I remember, like, because I didn't watch it right away when it... Ha when the fuck did Love actually come out? 2000 and... Was it right yeah. after 9 When I was 10? <laughs> well, I didn't watch it until I was maybe, like, 18. <laughs> yeah, But I just 18. remember being so charmed by it when I yeah, watched it. I was it too has, when I first watched it. It has some genuinely charming moments. As someone who yeah. who has to watch it every every Christmas. <laughs> or else he the witch's curse hits Nathan unless <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I I made maybe, you know, in retrospect the the pact I made, it didn't seem so bad at the time. But uh, I do have to watch it every Christmas. But look at you now. <laughs> it's like there are a few parts in there that genuinely make me laugh every time. Yeah. Like when the bodyguard has a really good singing voice. Yeah, that's always fun. <laughs> or the, the octopus awkwardly trying to get out of the car while um, Hugh Grant awkwardly tries to help him get out of the car. I watched that movie for the first time, what, last year? Yeah, with all of, we all watched it together, didn't we? Or did we not? I think Wait, everyone watched, watched it, for it the... from their own. That's abodes. right. We discussed it. Yeah. In, in did Discord. You, did you not watch it before we no. did the, the speed draw? The speed draw? No. You hadn't watched it. You just, you just went. You have for to, it. like, go into love, actually, with a pure heart <laughs> to enjoy it's... it. It's a it's a cultural artifact. Yeah, if you go in like if you watch it in this day and age, and you go in with any cynicism in your heart, like it's gonna be the stupidest shit you've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you need to go in so like you know bright eyed and bushy tailed in order to like experience what made it good. <laughs> yeah, you gotta clear from your mind like all existing knowledge you have about like the world and people yeah. and life Geo and also politics. the knowledge of like other movies you've seen get that out of there too yeah and approach yeah. it like this is one of the first things you've ever seen on a television yeah the first piece of media <laughs> you don't know who any of these people are you've never like heard a joke <laughs> you've never heard a joke before yeah <laughs> then you're you... gonna be busting <laughs> up when you watch this thing <laughs> You're going to be like, what is, the, what are they saying? Why is it making yeah, me have this reaction? You, you've not experienced much hardship. <laughs> <laughs> you're just, it's just like fluff. You, you go into it and it with fluff and you're like, oh, hell yeah. Yeah. Nice. 
Yeah, I I did not. I don't think I have the same affections for it, but it was like a fun, silly movie to watch. Yeah, um, it like it's, uh, it's silly. It is really silly. It's like an interesting time capsule of that time yeah. specifically in movies. The tropes they use, I'm like, ooh, I'm glad we've changed, kind of, yeah. in this way, at least. <laughs> I, because I, I'm just like, it's hard to look back and, like, s- <laughs> understand why I was, like, so, like, delighted and charmed by it. Like, I thought it was so fucking cute. And then there was one point where I just, like, watched it again and said, actually, this sucks. <laughs> it was when I noticed the fucking jump cut. Yeah. yeah. It, like, broke the illusion for me. The dancing jump cut in Jump From My Love. <laughs> and the fact that the music follows him everywhere. He, like, turns on a physical radio that plays the song, and then it follows him. Well, that's just, you know, that's just and something just the Prime Minister when he's can interrupted. Do. Yeah. And yeah. he says, let's move the Japanese ambassador to 2.30 or whatever. Anyway, movies, huh? Movies. You really can... We all have them. You can call anything a movie. <laughs> you shouldn't though. <laughs> but you can. But you can. Sometimes I don't I, think you should do that. I get in bed at the end of the night and I pick up my Kindle and I say to Julia, I'm gonna watch a movie real quick. And then I just sit in bed with my Kindle and, and then, it's not even on. And I call that I call that a movie. You think you see the movie that plays in your mind. And exactly. This is what I'm always saying. Because you <laughs> love movie cinema. That plays in my mind. It's just static. <laughs> is that a, a clover? No, he like gives her a box of like I think they're oh, supposed to be like Oh, it's the it's a flower. Yeah. Yeah, it's this little kid and he gives this box of flowers to his teacher who's Jennifer Garner and he's like, You're my Valentine. I'm in love with you. And she's like, and she's like <laughs> I'm, I'm cheating. thirty seven years helping old. helping s- someone cheat. No, she didn't know that, Nathan. But she Oh. She was a victim of the cheating. And so she and she makes this face and she's like, uh. well, the kids also I mean, like, what face would you make the kids in elementary school? And he's like, I love older women. Gross. Yeah. He says, usually I don't go. He said, usually I go for older women, but you'll do when he like talks no. to someone his own age. <laughs> Except, wait, what? <laughs> Excuse no. me. And I'm like, you're like eight. I don't, I don't think so. I don't think that's <laughs> what you should be saying. <laughs> and so Jennifer Garner is looking at him like this. Like, I don't. Uh, do you... I don't this think is... you should say that to anyone. <laughs> this is a lot. It's a lot to deal with, a lot to, to process right now. They also like. <laughs> at the I'm Indian about to restaurant. call your parents so bad. <laughs> <laughs> There's also, um, they like really. I don't know. I don't know if it was like poor planning, but they have like little details that they're like this will be a fun nod to the thing you saw yesterday because we don't know how to tie in these plot lines all that well. So we're going to have a kid that, like, he's at an age where he loves to, like, you know, pull his shirt over his face like you do when you're a little kid and you're like a little monster, you know? The Like, that's what the boy's doing (laughs) while he's playing soccer and he's like, I'm a... Mm -hmm. He's like, not in my house. And he's like, you know, this monster of a goalie. Yeah. Um, well, they've decided that later they'll show you that his dad is the guy who is the front of house for this restaurant by having pictures of his son on his front like desk thing, but only of the boy having the shirt over his head That's, twice. He refuses to take photos. Yeah. Otherwise, it's actually his favorite thing. It's a it's a struggle every time they try and take a photo of him because he does they just that. Stop bothering they just <laughs> yeah. accepted that that's his like favorite thing i um i really like the the face the way you drew jennifer garner's face <laughs> i that. really like the dog yeah. thank you <laughs> i'll go back to it in a second <laughs> yeah why'd you come back here because she realized the dog had spots <laughs> it's a black and white border like, i have to go back i have to fix it for accuracy 
I love it's Border important. Collies. <laughs> Um, <laughs> this kid has the most like deadpan expression the whole movie and um, he uh, every line you're my valentine usually I go for older women but you'll do I was like what what? Also, there's one actor, and every line he said was funny, and only because of his delivery every single time. Yeah. It's hard to describe his lines. They're just like notes about the things that are happening. This is too deep, Julia. We got to reverse it, out of this. It cracks me up. <laughs> We're too deep in. Oh, she's doing it again. <laughs> We're too deep into explanation. It's great. It was fun. It's a fun watch. It's like stupid i'm just but. i'm just thinking about this kid like giving his teacher flowers and being like usually i go for older women but you'll do like what would you do in that situation i personally would just chuckle and think to myself someday i'm gonna be eating dinner and i'll put on a true crime youtuber and they're gonna be talking about you <laughs> <laughs> talk about this kid i can just feel it in me bones They'll be like, why didn't someone do anything about this kid? And I'll be like, I don't know. I was too oh, busy. Bro, that's not my job. Not my job. I was too busy dating a married man that I didn't know was married. And then maybe dating Ashton Kutcher. I don't know. Anyway. Do you want to give this to Nathan? <laughs> yeah. Um, the child actor knew these lines were bad, too, and didn't want to say them. Is that true? <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> they were like... It's a paycheck, but I, I hate this character. <laughs> What's the That's, command? You had it. You were going to do it right. And H? you second guessed yourself. H? Yeah. I did. You, you fear. You fear your own knowledge. I didn't want to hit the thing that's like, pull up your home address and <laughs> oh, yeah. 30 numbers. That button. <laughs> the, the button that shows your social security number. I've got a special shortcut for that. Fuck. Just so I can live dangerously. Yeah, just in case. Um, is oh, it's back to me. Yeah. 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 Always oh, so, back to me. Someone in chat, by the way, uh, drawing suggestions for Jacob, uh, for Nathan. But the my my ragging on the child is less like the is not me ragging on the actual like kid actor. It's the fact that they no. had this child say these things. Bless yeah. you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Can I draw a ghost walrus? Ghost walrus. Ghost walrus. <clears throat> walrus. It's also just like, what a weird Can thing to make a, a child say. Yeah, they, they were, were just really video. like trying to get the exact same like energy and performance as the like kid in Love Actually. Yeah. Who is perfect? <laughs> yeah, he's great. Jojen Reed. He's such, he's such a charming little guy. Especially when he was extra whittle. Yeah. That's he, not the actor's name. That's another character that he played. He literally just looks like a kitten that got cursed to be a boy. <laughs> Maybe that's what happened. <laughs> Speaking of cursed kittens. <laughs> All's making her way. Ghost walrus. Ghost walrus. Oh, she's breathing, going by the water bottle. Jacob and I bought this snack the other day. It's a sweet potato puff sweet thing. Sweet potato puff. And it tastes exactly like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And I keep thinking Ooh. about it. Cool. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Yeah, that it's all bad. I want to eat. Bad selection. Let's try again. Okay, that was bad selection. Nathan, do you want to say it so everyone can hear you? You have something to share with the class? I'm just trying to. Oh no! I did it all on the same doing? layer. I gotta start over. What are you doing? <laughs> I gotta start over. That was a practice. <laughs> Let me look at that. They just over here making like boom hour noises. <laughs> <laughs> boom hour noises. Like oh no, I'm gonna say I'm going, man. <laughs> it's like a butterfly flapping his wings, making a tree fall. 
Ain't nobody here and nobody ever, no one ever happened. I just showed Jacob <laughs> this clip from this, like, I think it's from the 90s or maybe early 2000s of this woman doing like a little side story about the Scottish accent. And she goes off and she's like, um, you know, she's she's talking about how much she loves the Scottish accent and how beautiful it is, but that sometimes it's difficult to understand. But mm -hmm. she loves it, so she's going to talk to uh, Scottish people uh, on their thoughts about the accent. And the first person she pulls aside says, I have no idea what. And it pans back to her, and she just goes, hmm? <laughs> <laughs> she, she caught none of it. That's Not even great. enough to say what. Just like, hmm? <laughs> Good accent. It was a very funny clip. I I like the Welsh accent. Not to not to bring it back to uh, the Traders UK. My God. Oh no! Please. Here we go again. <clears throat> no, please We've set don't. Them off. I'm don't just saying. Unactivate. It's... Control Alt Delete. Task Hard. Manager. End task. End task. <laughs> End task. <laughs> Apparently it's the two kids. It's hard to sound suspicious and when, task. with a Welsh <laughs> accent. Is all I'm saying. It's like you hear someone with a Welsh accent, and it sounds like they they either just thought of what they were saying, like as they were saying it, or it's something that's been like passed down for generations. Like there's no scheming involved. That's all. That's my. That's my Welsh accent take nathan thinks welsh people can't scheme i think Damn. that they i think that they don't sound like they scheme which means that they're the perfect schemers that. they actually it actually improves their ability they I, i'm just saying if a welsh person wants to to scam me they already have a leg up It'll be hear easy that, to do. Sheets. Yeah. <laughs> Get his ass. Get his ass. He's not going to suspect a thing. I'm not going to. I'm not going to suspect a thing. It also means if you want to scam Nathan via text, you can just type in parentheses in a Welsh accent <laughs> yeah, and then whatever you were going to say. Or or two stars around it. You know, yeah. Welshly. Welshly. Said spoken Welshly. Welshly. <laughs> spoken Welshly. <laughs> Ghost walrus. Mm -hmm. Kind of doing like a lounging pose. Hey, did y'all know that tomorrow we're doing a we're <sighs> gonna be on Project for Awesome? Whoa! Stream. If you're watching yeah, it live, that. if you're if, watching yeah. this live, if you're watching we're speaking this live, to you, if you're watching the vod, it's too late. You should have been did it here. already. Where were you? Where were we? Really looking you. forward to you being here, but I guess unless you're watching the vibe tomorrow before. Go on. We stream, or <laughs> later tonight, <laughs> which I guess is possible. So there's but some edge cases. There's some edge cases. But we're gonna be on it at four o'clock p.m. Eastern time tomorrow. Yeah. With Hank Green yeah. raising money, yeah, wow. for charity. Wow, we're going to be making stickers for the that's going to be sold in the bundle that you can buy. Wow, for the charity. Yeah. Wow. Official merch. Yes. Of us, from us, for them. Of us. Of, of us. us. Probably not us, of us. From us for us. By us, yeah. four kids TV, four <laughs> K, in four K, four K art, twenty four K magic. Is that how it was that what the name of the song was? I don't I know. Fucked up. I fucked up. <laughs> someone, someone help. <laughs> but I guess a lot of our art is in four K. I feel like we usually draw in like four K. At full big. resolution. That's we do yeah. we do 180p 
180p? I don't think that's what we do. Sorry. That would be really small. One eighty p one hundred and eighty takes out yeah. the phone flashlight. <laughs> yeah. We, it's just it's the only resolution that doesn't automatically kill Victorian men, so that's what we do. Because <laughs> we have such a large Victorian man uh segment of our audience. Victorian man audience, we see you, we hear you. This is for you. Yeah. You know, I was saying like our drawings themselves at full res oh, are like at 4K. That's what you're talking about, hey. They're usually full like 4800. Full res, like on our Patreon. Like when you support us on Patreon, like they're already what, doing people, that, but at so higher tiers. Said. But at higher tiers, they're already here. They're doing it. By the way, um, someone asked if the project for Awesome was going to be on Twitch or on, oh my god, or on YouTube. It's on YouTube. To find the link, you can go to uh, projectforawesome.com slash live. That's where you can watch it live. Uh, you can also go to the Vlog Brothers YouTube channel to watch it live. Damn, it'd be crazy if you could Google that information. <laughs> but you can't. You gotta have Julia tell you. It's the only way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bro, I wasn't gonna say it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, encouraging people to come watch, and you know, people <laughs> just are interested and um, want to see he's it. Encouraging <laughs> them to learn better life skills. That's be what I'm doing. And I think that's wonderful. <laughs> if I'm if I'm rude about it every time, maybe they'll stop. <laughs> people will learn how they'll to learn not to search up information. <laughs> I see so many comments calling me like mean, <laughs> saying I mean to like everyone, yeah. and I just want to shout them out right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh. You're, don't worry, you're both mean. It's Yay. not mean; it's just a little sassy. Yeah, <laughs> but when I do it, it's mean because I'm a woman. <laughs> That's true. I forgot about that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But when you do it, it's cute because you're a man. <laughs> yeah. And I think that's great for me. Yeah, I'm really happy for you. Just so we're clear. Don't worry, I'll get an email about it complaining about Jacob's <laughs> behavior. <laughs> yeah. Julia it, gets the longest email. It's Julia's fault. She gets the email about it. Yeah. <laughs> I want really... everyone to know who sends me a very long email that I I have so many emails that come in that I will skim most of them to see like if there's an immediate thing that's gonna it's gonna happen. But my fun hobby is if it's particularly long, I will copy and paste it into a Google Doc and look at the word count. And so far, we're at like a fourteen hundred word count That's for the, the most number to words. beat. You know I what do. to do, chat. I get in the email. Don't. You know what to do, chat. Don't email me. Don't yeah, email me about you someone will else's behavior. Get your email address blocked. And then what? When you have a real problem. <laughs> now, my favorite thing about that is that <laughs> that's what I would do whenever I would get like weird long comments on <laughs> my Yu Gi Oh! YouTube videos. Because Yu Gi Oh! fans, <clears throat> mostly men, usually just have a lot to say <laughs> to me. <laughs> <laughs> because I said Yu Gi Oh! GX is objectively the best, clearly as a joke, but. <laughs> um, and so I start my Yu Gi Oh! How could that be five. objective? <laughs> there is no math or science proving that. Also, it's, you, it's you all objectively. 
Uh, so I started my arc five video by just like shitting on them for doing that. <laughs> and it's honestly really funny of me, honestly. But I did run the longest one through a word count and it's literally like one or two words longer than the <laughs> email Julia got. Yeah. Oh, wow. okay, okay. <laughs> and I was like, clearly they don't care more than this guy because they would have added those two extra words. <laughs> <laughs> like a true champion yeah they should have thought about that but they didn't so something with this i don't know if i like this effect that i've got going but oh but you know. i do like it okay. uh, yeah okay. i think it looks very nice okay 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 It's never occurred to me to email Drawfee. Here's the thing about all or Thank most, you. most of the emails we get. I hope it never occurs to you. Just side note. Unless you're a Drafficion auto tier and you're emailing a drawing request by following the instructions. There's so many things on the internet. I don't know if it's because of like me personally and how I operate or like our our generation of like about when we were younger generation. comment stuff like this didn't exist all that much you really had to like find a forum yeah yeah for the thing but find a forum. the amount of times where i've seen something and just let been like i'm like i i've never left a comment under a youtube video i think unless it was yeah. like in response to someone for drawfee who was like asking me a question or something like i've never like left a youtube comment yeah i haven't either or like yeah. sent that person an email or like i've definitely like tweeted yeah. at people before obviously but and i feel I mean, like my like, interactions are low i like it a nice comments the so nice oh, comments yeah. are so good because <laughs> i've never nice i don't comment. leave nice comments either i'm like someone has to go out of their way yeah. to like write a comment i don't that they don't even know if any anyone's comments. gonna see that's saintly behavior right I, there. that's really nice if you Bart, leave a nice yeah. comment I do see it and it does make my day better. So thank you. I have far too much social anxiety to like interact with most people ever, especially over the internet in any form. So I'm just like, damn, people do just be saying things. And a lot of the time it's like really nice things. The nice the nice comments and emails, so greatly appreciated. And yeah, I you. I yeah. should do that more as I'm an enjoyer a... of things. I'm just going to, I'm going to be done with this okay. ghost walrus. I really like this ghost oh walrus. God. I just want you to know that. Thank you. You got rid of it very quickly. <laughs> Is it me? Okay. Hit me, hit me, chat. Suggestions uh, for Karina. You please. could do the Ace Attorney cats now. Oh. If you wanted. I could see if, if, if chat wants. That's what they um, wanted the but... other time, too. And they said that I superseded that's them. That's what Zappy wanted. <laughs> <laughs> and I do experience favoritism towards Zappy, but like, I'll let them, I'll let them throw out a few attempts. Um, experience have, favoritism yes. towards Zappy. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, people who just like interact a lot on the internet are just built different than me. If yeah, I have yeah. to send like a message in someone's Twitch chat, like a personal friend's Twitch chat, more than once, I experience full e ego death. <laughs> I get that. It's really bad. <laughs> I just can't imagine having like a minor issue with someone's like three hour long video and then being like, I'm gonna leave a nasty email about this one. Not that that. No, okay. I'm not saying like that happened. Yeah. I'm making up an, an example, but here's here's the thing about the guy that left like a really fucking long uh, comment on my Yu-Gi-Oh GX video that I ran through word count and then made an example of in the intro of my next video is that because I, I I joke I'm just like please leave a longer comment this time. And he fucking did it. Wow. <laughs> good and he, he was kind of doing it like in good, like, like in good jest, good uh, humor. Um, so it, it actually made me really happy. And I don't know if he like deleted, like the comment got deleted or 
something, but I haven't been able to find it in a long time, but it like made me, <laughs> it made me chuckle. I think I just replied to it. Oh my God, you're back. <laughs> 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 Hell yeah, dude. I, I was trying to say you crazy son of a bitch, you did it, but mm. YouTube kept blocking my comment <laughs> when I said bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I think my thing so, too is like- I appreciated that. Leaving a long comment, arguing about okay, this just... like- I'll draw the scrungly cats after all. All right. Scrungly cats. Um, arguing about this character being better or whatever and leaving a 1500 word comment about it is like, I think instead of arguing with a stranger about who's best in the show, I'm going to do something else. Yeah. Just like, appreciate play your a video favorite game, character. Go relax. Just There's, be like, I disagree with this person. <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, it's like the opposite energy of being like, wow, it's incredible to me that people take time out of their day to say something nice to us. Like that's so touching and like, you know, yeah. blows my mind. It's it's incredible in the opposite direction to me that people take the time out of their day to say something mean or like type up a long mean message. I'm like, that's time of your life, man. You could have been you could have been doing anything with that. You could have used that time to go to someone you like and tell them something nice. But That's instead, yeah. you spent yeah. it increasing net negativity in the That's world. That's me at any Yu-Gi-Oh fan whenever they do that shit cuz you sometimes they do it in a way that's like very like disparaging and like thinly veiled sexism a lot of the time or homophobia. <laughs> so I'm yeah. just like, "Oh, boy <laughs> and i'm just like <laughs> just make your own thingy just appreciate it in your own way sorry i'm like harder working than you <laughs> oh my god <laughs> apparently there's a person on youtube that comments on every single guilty gear tournament video complaining that their character needs buffs and he's becoming huh. infamous for it. Apparently, I don't, I don't oh, think nice. that's where you can solve that problem, commenter. But go <laughs> is off. it the Melee? Is it is it actually someone complaining about Melia Rage? And so the guy's called Melia Rage guy because wow. that's hilarious. You know, she does need to be buffed though. <laughs> that's it's Julia. Commitment. That's my character. Julia's the guy. <laughs> I used to oh win tournaments God, off of Melia Rage. <laughs> we found him. He's Julia. I used to win tournaments using Melia Rage, and then they made her so useless. She gets hit once, and that's it for her. Julia's the guy. Julia's the guy. But she's using our Patreon stream to leave the comment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's on the Drawfee official account. This is Drawfee's official stance on Melia Rage. Yeah. Buff Melia. Buff Melia. I just remembered that one guy that was like <laughs> tweeting at me during Anime NYC and I kept replying even though I had no like bars at the convention center because <laughs> I replied to someone's tweet saying Yu-Gi-Oh! GX is objectively the best one. It was Yu-Gi-Oh! everything because he was like, give me your hot takes and I was like, oh, oh, Dylan, I got I got a hot take right here and then someone replied being like what are you talking about sexual is obviously the best one and i just replied no trust me <laughs> there's scientific <laughs> proof or something and he just kept arguing back and i'm like no 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 like there's proof no it's have you not seen the evidence <laughs> my, my source is trust me yeah. i'm a researcher in this field many scientists are saying this <laughs> yeah. I, I should have him pointing more to the side. That's good. This is this is to say thank you to uh, the majority yeah. of you who um, don't don't make the internet bad. Yeah. Yeah, like the ninety nine point nine percent of you that are good. It we feels. It. Um, yeah. It it feels petty and unappreciative to complain, but we have to we have to see some strange things to see the good stuff too that's all yeah and sometimes it's just like funny to complain yeah thanks for letting yeah. us complain not that you could have stopped <laughs> us yeah yeah <laughs> you're not in the room to like physically restrain <laughs> us so like you were getting it no matter what 
I guess if like everyone in chat simultaneously started typing stop complaining in all caps, I probably would stop complaining. Or maybe I would complain more. Do you guys more. like it when we complain? Do you like the chisme? What is, what's that, Karina? The goss, the hot goss, the chisme. I don't know that term. That's what my friend says whenever we like get to hang out or whenever I complain to him about literally anything, like at random times, he's just like, I do love chisme. <laughs> what does it mean though? <laughs> I think it's like gossip. Is it like another language? Yeah, it's Spanish. Yeah, um, it's gossip. Oh, I learned something today. <laughs> <laughs> Chat saying, keep complaining. <laughs> <laughs> complain more. <laughs> All right, Can here you we complain go. <laughs> louder, please. <laughs> I'm about to go off. I'm not going to go off. That's really no. all we had yeah, to I don't, complain I don't about. Honestly, else to go off about. No, we did it. We did it. It's it's really it's really nice having a community yeah. that's so majorly positive. There's always more to complain about, but it's it's not all it's not fun for us to put that on you. We Never. like you. We like you. I put that on my friend who likes cheese <laughs> Do y'all, um, y'all in chat, you got anything you want to complain about? Yeah, we'll complain yeah. about it for you. We'll complain yeah. about it for you. You can type anything it in. You, we'll... Anything you want us to complain about? Within reason? As long as it's not us. Yeah. No, yeah, if it's I'll us, we will ban you from chat. <laughs> <laughs> Unless it's Nathan. I can complain about myself. Yeah. It's always more of a delay on YouTube streams, so we have to wait longer to get. Oh my god, chat I hate gratification. the delay on YouTube streams. Oh my god, when are they gonna fix that? Can I tell you about uh, an email we just got? Yeah. <laughs> sure. The subject line, and I'm not gonna open this email because I don't know what's in it, and I don't want to. I don't want Google to think that I want to keep seeing these emails. Beaver in your mailbox. Beaver but it's one mailbox. of the there Republican one. <laughs> like websites, so I don't know what this means. I don't know Beaver what that in means your mailbox. Beaver, Beaver in your mailbox. It's, it's a classic prank the teens do. Beaver yeah. in your mailbox. They put a beaver in your mailbox. You open <laughs> it to get your <laughs> mail. And... Um, a lot of lot of great topics to complain about in chat. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot. I'll do I'll I can do motion smoothing on TVs. Oh, don't even get me started. Fuck that. Fuck that. Shit <laughs> is you what want, I have to say about you, that. You want to hear a rant that I went on with Jacob the other day? Ooh, yeah. Lay it on me. Big tall Yoshi. burgers. I hate them. Too tall. Too tall. And the you burgers can't eat are them. too tall. Yeah. Too Here's tall the for your thing. mouth. The like restaurants will be like, we're gonna make a big burger because it looks nice on Instagram, because it looks like you want to eat it. But when I see it, I don't want to eat it. You know what I do want to eat when I see it? Like slider versions of burgers. I want a little. I want it to fit in my mouth. I want to be able to take a bite of the burger and have it all go in mm -hmm, my mouth. Mm -hmm. Little munchable things that I can just pop into my mouth. I'm always gonna want to do that. Yep. Give me a give slider. Me a little burger. Give me a popper. Give me a smash burger. Don't make the smash burger inconvenient the burger. for me. If you want to make it bigger, make it wider, not mm -hmm. taller. Mm -hmm. Make it long. <laughs> give best, me a long burger. The best thing Bear Burger did recently was they made their burgers smaller, and then you can opt for a one or two patty. And in my opinion, one patty is plenty. Mm-hmm. Tell them. There's plenty of beef in there, and then you get all the toppings, all the condiments, the bacon, the cheese. When I order my cheeseburger, that's what I say. I say, cheese me. <laughs> burger, man. Oh my god. <laughs> I liked it. Someone in chat's complaint was hate everyone hating a character you like. Parentheses, I genuinely like Scrappy Doo. And oh, I like sorry. to imagine that you've been waiting so sorry. to defend Scrappy Doo. 
I think we make fun of Scrappy Doo in Tuesday's Drawfee video. Oh no, maybe don't watch that one. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I think I make a noise that you you guys make fun of me. For. I make fun of myself as well because I wasn't expecting to make Cheers. spoilers. I make I make a a surprisingly Scrappy Doo sounding noise. Oh, so. I do not remember that one bit. Here's the thing. I will only make fun of things like I will I will only rip in the things that um I love or yeah. enjoy. It's I'm good cool and healthy and normal. Yeah. I agree. Yeah. I would never like really make fun of something I hate. Scrappy Doo will fight a ghost. Scooby Doo is a craven glutton. <laughs> 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 that seems like something that would be on like a picket sign <laughs> like outside of Cartoon Network I hate the gluttonous dog <laughs> the craven glutton Scooby He's a runs coward away and a again <laughs> Scrappy Doo is smaller yet he experiences more bravery he displays more bravery in the face of ghosts and ghouls <laughs> Scooby runs away from a man in a rubber mask and eats a sandwich. <laughs> I think I genu genuinely agree, but there was, I think I brought this up one stream, but Jacob and I were hanging out with my brother and his family, and uh, my niece, as always, was watching Scooby-Doo, and uh, Scrappy-Doo came out to the screen and she went, ugh. It was really cute. It was very funny. <laughs> Not even three years old, and she already has a disdain. She's already, she's already sick of him. For I looked at my brother, and he was like, "Oh uh, yeah, she doesn't like Scrappy Doo." <laughs> he doesn't care for Scrappy Doo. <laughs> she doesn't like. Um, she doesn't like. Uh. <laughs> I, I think she doesn't like like rowdy characters. She he's prefers too, he's a craving too glutton. loud. Because <laughs> she doesn't like when her brother is too loud either. <laughs> I don't think I ever had a problem with Scrappy Doo growing up. No, I'll say I just it. associate him with with um, Harvey Birdman. Every time he shows up, he gets he gets scooped by uh, by Avenger. Falcon. I know we had this exact conversation. Recently. Can I change the subject? Can I complain about I've been waiting for my opportunity to explain what the fuck I'm drawing? Yes. And I haven't had it. Explain it. <laughs> These are from a thing that Onsta sent me. I don't remember if I even like told you guys about it. No. Mm -mm. Cuz Capcom does all these like artist collabs, but they're mostly for Monster Hunter. And so um, they finally did one with this one artist that just draws like absolute scrungled up cats and it was Ace Attorney and it was a fucking online lottery. So um, Onsta and I uh, entered it. <laughs> um, I paid for everything and she did the lottery pulls and we accidentally won the top prize. So that was part of the package she sent. That's amazing. And you wanna know what the top prize was? Yeah. <laughs> You see this, you see this phoenix, right? Yeah. Now imagine that it was a clock. In what way? And like this the hand is the is minute the hand? hand. This Ooh, is the minute hand. <laughs> that's incredibly good. <laughs> so it's hanging in my living room now. I'm so excited to see it. <laughs> There's a, just a lot of very good art for it. <laughs> he has to dislocate his shoulder to tell you the stuff between six I and know it's the best. 12. But he'll do it. <laughs> he'll do it for you. Yeah. <laughs> Let me do it for you. For the time. That's awesome. I'm but glad you I didn't you win won. any Edgeworths. Thank you. Um, That wasn't even the prize I was going for, but imagine my shock when we actually won it. <laughs> but yeah, I forgot what the... I can look up the name. Shock uh, clock. Kyaku Pens. Aiban. He's attorney. Turnaround court. X. Shiko. Doneko. That's the artist. I love it. I'm going to look it them up. So cute. You should look them up because they also did Monster Hunter ones. They have 
they have all the best collabs for Monster Hunter. So whenever there's an Ace Attorney one, I lose my fucking mind. I mean, as a certified Monster Hunter myself, I'm pretty thrilled by this. Yeah. I'm something of a Monster Hunter myself. I'll hunt them. If they show their face around here. Yeah. And then in two to three other locations. <laughs> Actually, can I? I can show chat because I have the image kind of easy enough to pull up that the face that Edgeworth makes is so funny to me. Just kidding. That's a, a fucking web P. Web P. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. <laughs> <laughs> you love to see that. That's my clock. No. I love how far away the hair part is from the center of the face. <laughs> <laughs> this clock is so busted. <laughs> I love it's it. It's so funny. <laughs> Midnight is just a cat. I'm <laughs> I'm 12. so happy about it. <laughs> but yeah, this whole collab was really, really good. And I'm just really grateful Ansta was able to help me participate in it. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> just the other ones do I have? Again, I didn't win a lot of the stuff with Edgeworth on it. Because um, we did do as many pulls as we could to like split with people. But here's the other characters. I love them. They're so good. <laughs> I love Apollo. <laughs> he's, he's so he's frantic. Constipated. <laughs> oh, the but judge yeah, is really good. good too. The judge is so good. <laughs> they're all so good. So yeah, I I was very happy with that. So this yeah. is my fan art. I'm going to stop and make Jacob draw for like two seconds. Draw for like two seconds, Jacob or Julia. Please. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll pop in. Excuse me, Olive. Thank you. I'm here. Okay. Okay. There's that boy. <laughs> He's so, he looks like the fucking <laughs> Kevin Smith image turned young. <laughs> young Kevin. And like sad. <laughs> is, is that what, is, is that the correct, did I, you know. I'm trying to think of what image you're talking about. Wait, was that not Kevin Smith? some white man the no, one where he's like <laughs> the one that was yeah. going around recently smith i might just not yeah. have seen it yeah it did yeah the it one is... where he's like slumped he's I sort of a slump. i don't think i've seen it i believe you that there is an image of kevin smith where he's slumped yeah Right, what I believe am I you. I believe that. Oh, oh, I don't. Oh think no, you're Kevin. Kevin, Smith. Kevin James. You're thinking of Kevin James. <laughs> Kevin oh James. yes, I do a know that Kevin. one. Kevin James. <laughs> Thank you, Chad. <laughs> of course. Thank you, Chad. That makes a White lot of sense. White men named Kevin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like doing a little shrug. He's doing a little schlump. Like it's Aww, exactly. Me? It's exactly. Exactly as Karina described, it yeah, was just the wrong slump. Kevin. I don't even think it was Kevin. James and Smith are basically the same last name in my yeah. brain, honestly. That could that's just a name. Ain't nothing but a name. I'm gonna draw my own version of the Kevin James image. I got the first name right. Honestly, that's better than expected. That's a fifty percent. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, I I bet there's an alternate reality where like those two men just have swapped careers and everything else is exactly the same. 
just Kevin Smith was on King of Queens and Kevin James was Silent Bob. Could you imagine? Could you imagine? What a world no. that would be. It's exactly the same. I don't think I even same. know who Kevin Smith is. I just thought that was the name. He's Silent Bob. Yeah, Kevin Smith is... Um, <laughs> doesn't mean anything. He's the clerk's one. He's from Clerks and Mallrats and Dogma and... Dogma. And Dogma and Balls. Silent Bob Dogma Strike. Balls. Dogma Balls. <laughs> <laughs> They're always saying that. Where'd Julia go? All Blart Mall Rat. Yeah, exactly. She went out. I hear her eating those sweet potato snacks. He's drawing it. I think he's, he's drawing snacking. It extra shapey. <laughs> Kevin Shapey. He's Stop, gonna... you'll just make me more confused. He's got like a little head. He's got like a flat yeah. top situation. Yeah. But he's going, <laughs> he's going, hmm, who me? Who me? <laughs> Do you even know my last name? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know my first name? <laughs> oh Good shit, enough. he's on to me. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's more like, it's more like this. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I was going to say the face Julia drew on um, Jennifer Garner in uh, in her drawing could be a, a reaction image to um, receiving a very long email. <laughs> That's so true. It Damn. could it could be that it could be that. I, I probably could have said that in a funnier way, but yeah, it maybe was just like, a, in the most like timid it, way possible. It was just like it was just sort of like an idea I had, and I thought I'd, I'd share it with you, my friends here on, uh, on the stream. And we can sort, workshop sort, it. Sort of see how you felt about that. You know, yeah. maybe like a different way, a different time. Yeah, like yeah. when the image was on screen. Mm -hmm. Could yeah, have been a, when a time it would have made it. more sense. Yeah, I think I, I maybe yeah. maybe missed my window to to bring that up in in sort of a way that would have been entertaining, but uh, but I think but you still, know, I just... it's important that we talk about it. <laughs> I'm so, I, yeah, yeah I, thank so, you. So we can do better. In thank the you future. for making space for me to to have this dialogue with you. About I feel it. closer to you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> This is beautiful. You're Jay, beautiful. We really, this is really good. Is this <laughs> is this giving you the same vibes? Yeah, you've you've done it. And then he's kind of like I... this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who me? I know it's just what he looks like, but it does look like, like someone just like sh like jack o' lanterned his head a little bit. Especially with the underdrawing, it's a hole. Head like a hole. Head like a hole. This is what Trent Reznor was saying. Yeah. He was talking about <laughs> Kevin James being lobotomized. <laughs> but he's got to be looking at us. That's important. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. him. <laughs> it's you. <laughs> it's you. Kevin Mann. <laughs> he sees Kevin, you. Kevin Smith. Oh, he needs like way more, way more forehead. <laughs> we got to get this down. We got to shrink this down. <laughs> sort of get that right there. Yeah, dude. That's you, how I feel you sometimes. See Kevin James seeing you. What do you do? How do I, you open? I, I mirror <laughs> his his body language. I'd be like, oh, oh wait, 
Are you, are you, you Kevin? Kevin Smith? <laughs> it's really important to me that I get this right. You um I you got it right. You have my support. <laughs> if this stream has to go for another half hour for you to get this right, you have my support. Just like agonize over this. <laughs> just do a full render. <laughs> Tears streaming down our face because we can't leave. <laughs> She's like, Jacob, please. <laughs> and I'm like, no, he's I not. can't do this anymore. He's not perfect yet. <laughs> my perfect Kevin. <laughs> He's not right. <laughs> I need to, must, I must craft my perfect Kevin. Then I must bring him to life. Okay. I'm done. Okay, yeah. We'll put a little porfo in here. Yeah. Yeah. Doing the same pose. Yeah, he's gonna be doing the same <laughs> On his shoulder. Same oh, face, yeah. yeah. Cute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what a gift. <laughs> what a perfect way to end the stream. Thank you all so much for supporting us on Patreon. We really appreciate it. Okay, now yeah, more than I'm ever. Back to say bye. She's in the okay. bathroom. Why? So I can't tell her to do that. But I can tell them the patrons goodbye from Julia. Julia to yeah. B room. To B room. <laughs> Julia to P. Julia, Julia to, P. to P. J to P. J to P. <laughs> um, yeah. Appreciate you all. Thanks for watching. If you're watching live, tune in tomorrow for project for awesome if you're not watching live that's okay <laughs> you missed it Sorry. you missed it well, maybe. maybe you didn't miss it maybe it, it was a very brief window yeah where you maybe didn't miss it we'll see we'll see you you let us know if you missed it if you missed it <laughs> <laughs> or, didn't. or didn't or didn't tell us tell us about it leave us a long email explaining whether or not yeah. you missed it. 1,500 words. If it's words. less words than that one guy who commented on my Yu-Gi-Oh video, I'm not reading it. <laughs> <laughs> and if it's more words, why would you write more words? I can't read. Get real. <laughs> All right, Come thanks, on. everybody. We'll see Thank you next you. time. Thank you. We're sorry. Bye. Sorry. Bye. Bye. Okay.